Are you an electronic engineer who started a clean stack? Maybe you're watching colleagues with less experienced Landos, 100K plus senior PCB design roles, or you're still debugging the same EMI issues that have plagued you for months. Or perhaps you're dreaming of starting your own consulting business, but you lack the confidence and advanced skills that clients actually pay premium rates for. Maybe you're early in your career and frustrated because university taught you circuit theory, but nobody showed you how to actually design a PCB that passes EMC compliance on the first try. Or you could be a seasoned engineer who's tired of working in isolation, spending weeks solving problems that could be resolved in hours if you just had the access to the right expertise and community. If any of these resonate with you, then you're exactly where you need to be, because what I'm about to share with you will change everything about how you approach electronic design and your career. Before we go any further, you're probably asking yourself, why should I even listen to this guy? And so first question, so let me introduce myself. I'm Dario and electronic isn't just my profession, but it's also my passion. As a fourth generation electrical professional, this field is literally my blood and I've been involved in it since childhood. I'm an IPC certified interconnect designer and also the principal engineer and EMI specialist at the company I founded, raceelectronics.com. And as of now, over 55,000 people follow my work. So far, I've trained senior engineers at leading aerospace and defense manufacturers, including subsidiaries of Fortune 500 companies. And I voted the EMI Control Guy series and read the technical articles for Altium. Prior to that, I've worked also as a technical expert and lead the hardware engineer at ETH Zurich, one of the world's most prestigious technical universities. But here is what really matters. Before I launched my consulting business, I was already earning over $14,000 per month as an engineer. Why? Because I understood the something that most engineers miss. Specialized expertise, especially in EMI control, is incredibly valuable and companies will pay handsomely for it. But I also remember what it was like to struggle with the same challenges you might be facing right now. So let me guess, you have had that sinking feeling when your board comes back from EMC testing with multiple failures. The schedule is short, the budget is blown, and everyone's looking at you for answers you don't have. You spend sleepless night wondering if you should have put that via there or if the ground plane was the issue or if something completely different that no textbook ever covered. Because let's be honest, isn't an EMI supposed to be black magic? And here is what really hurts. You know you're a good engineer. You understand the theory, you can read schematics and design circuits. But when it comes to laying out a PCB that actually works in the real world, especially in terms of EMI, you feel like you are missing some crucial piece of the puzzle. You have tried Googling EMI PCB design and reading application notes, but they are either too basic or too advanced. And you need someone to look at your specific design and tell you exactly what's wrong and how to fix it. You see other engineers presenting at conferences, getting promoted to lead roles, starting successful consulting businesses, and you wonder, what do they know that you don't? But here is the thing that really gets under your skin. You know you are as smart as them. Maybe smarter. You've seen their work and honestly, you could probably do it better. But somehow they are the one getting recognized, getting the opportunities, getting paid what you wish you were making. And the truth is, it's not about being smarter. It's about having the access to the right knowledge, the right mentorship and the right community. They learn the shortcuts, the tricks, the things that separate good engineers from great PCB designers. And you're still figuring out the hard way. And here's what nobody tells you about being an engineer. It can be incredibly lonely. You're working on complex problems that most people can even understand, let alone help you solve. Your colleagues are either too busy with their own project or they don't have the specific expertise you need. So you end up spending days or weeks stuck on problems that someone with more experience would probably solve in an hour or less. And you're constantly second-guessing yourself. Should I use four-layer boards or six-layer boards? Where should I put the ground planes? How do I write these high-speed signals? And the worst part is you don't even know what you don't know. You might be making mistakes that will cause problems later, but you won't find out until it's too late. And here's what nobody tells you. The difference between a good engine and a great PCB designer isn't just technical knowledge. It's not the unwritten rules, the industry secrets, the practical wisdom that only comes from years of experience or from learning directly from those who have that experience. And so university taught you how to analyze circuits and calculate impedances, but did they teach you how to place components to minimize crosstalk? Or did they show you how to route differential pairs on a real board with real constraints? Or did they even teach you how radiated emissions relate to the printed circuit board layout that you designed? Probably not. And that's not your fault, but it is your problem to solve. Look, I know what you really want. You want to be the engineer that everyone comes to when they have a difficult design problem. You want to walk into a room and have people respect your expertise. You want to feel confident when you're making design decisions 
Knowing that your board will work the first time, you want to be able to look at a schematic and immediately know the best way to lay out the PCB. You want to understand why certain approaches work and others don't. You want to have the deep, intuitive understanding that separates the expert from everyone else. And if you are thinking about freelancing or consulting, you want to be able to confidently tell a client, yes, I can design that for you, knowing that you have the skills to deliver exactly what they need on time and on budget. And most of all, you want to stop feeling like you're always one step behind. You want to be ahead of the curve using the latest techniques and best practices. You want to be proud of your work and excited about your career. And so let's talk about money for a minute, because whether you want to admit it or not, this is about more than just the technical satisfaction. Senior PCB designer with real expertise can easily command 120K to 180K per year. Freelance PCB designer charge anywhere from $75 to $200 per hour for their services. And if you can build a reputation as someone who consistently delivers board, the Works the first time, client will pay premium rates for that peace of mind. But here is the thing, you can't fake expertise in PCB design. Clients and employers can't tell the difference between someone who really knows what they're doing and someone who's just winging it. And the market rewards their expertise accordingly. So the question is, how long are you willing to stay at your current level while others pass you by? And that's exactly why I created this academy. The only community specifically designed for electronic engineers who are serious about becoming true PCB design and EMI control experts. This isn't another online course that you will start and never finish. This isn't a forum where you post a question and hope someone answers. But this is a living, breathing community of engineers who are all committed to pushing each other to the next level. And here's what makes this different from anything else you have tried. First, you get direct access to me and other senior electronic designers who have been where you are and know exactly what it takes to get where you want to go. We review your designs, answer your question, and help you avoid the expensive mistakes that can derail your projects. When you're stuck on a design problem, you don't have to spend days Googling and hoping for the best. You can post your question and get the answer from people who may have solved that exact problem before. Second, we work through real electronic design challenges together. No theoretical textbook problems, but actual design the members are working on. And you will see the thought process behind every decision. And so you can learn from other people's mistakes and build your intuition from what works and what doesn't. And every month we do deep dives into specific topics, high-speed digital design, power integrity, EMI mitigation, thermal management, signal integrity. We don't just talk the theory, we show you exactly how to apply this concept to real designs. Third, and I would say also most importantly, you become part of a community of engineers who understand what you're going through. People who can celebrate your successes and help you through your challenges. People who can introduce you to opportunities and help you advance your career. And so this isn't just about the technical skills. It's about building relationships with people who share your passion for good design and also commitment to excellence. And finally, we help you leverage your growing expertise into career advancement. Whether you want to get promoted at your current job, land a better position somewhere else, or start your own freelancing business, we show you exactly how to position yourself and market your skills. Because technical expertise without business acumen will only take you so far. You need to know how to communicate your value, negotiate your worth, and build a reputation that opens uh, doors. Now, I want to be completely transparent with you. Your success depends entirely on how committed you are to learning and apply this principle. I can provide you with the knowledge and community support, but ultimately, your results will depend on your dedication to mastering electronic design and EMI control. That said, here's what typically happens when engineers commit to developing their EMI expertise. In your first month, you will likely start to understand why your designs have been failing EMC tests. You will learn the fundamental principle of PCB layout and you will start applying them to your current projects. By month three, many of our members report approaching PCB design with much more confidence, especially when it comes to EMI control. And they understand how to place components to minimize electromagnetic interference, how to route to critical signal properly, and what design rules actually matter for EMC compliance. By month six, you might find yourself becoming the person your colleagues come to for PCB design and EMI control advice. You likely have developed an intuitive understanding of what works and what doesn't, and you will be able to look at our schematics and immediately see the best layout approach. And by month 12, you might find yourself in a much stronger position professionally, whether that's a promotion at your current job or a better position elsewhere, or maybe success 
successfully freelancing and earning what you are really actually worth. Most importantly, you will likely have the confidence and specialized knowledge to take on any PCB design and EMI control challenge. And you will probably find yourself proud of your work and excited about your future in this field. And now you might be thinking, does it actually work? So let me show you how we have helped other engineers develop their expertise. Take Joaquin, for example, an analytical system design engineer with over 16 years of experience in technical design and project management. He works on high stake design for Federal Aviation Administration, military and also commercial sector. In these environments, EMC compliance is an option. It's absolutely critical. And the principle he has learned through the same programs you will get access to have been invaluable in his demanding role. Or consider Gabriele, a hardware engineer with over 12 years of experience, is not only applying EMI control concept to his own designs, but also teaching these same principles to his students and sharing this specialized knowledge through his YouTube classes. Then there is Matt, who is now confidently applying this knowledge to his daily projects, using the same principle we teach in his electronic design work. And Merjim, who was able to quickly earn the trust of his manager and colleagues in a new role at a new company, by demonstrating his electronic design expertise and EMI knowledge. Not to mention Samuel, who experienced significant improvement in both confidence and technical expertise, enabling to tackle EMI problem and understand the electronic design process more thoroughly. And so this academy is specifically designed for engineers who are ready to take the next step in their careers, to specialize in PCB design and become the go-to EMI expert at their company or within their freelancing or consulting business. Now, if you wanted to get this level of expertise and support on your own, what would it cost you? A single consultation with a senior PCB design expert can cost $500 to $2,000. A single comprehensive PCB design or EMI control course from a reputable institution can cost $500 to $5,000. And if you make even one costly design mistake, it could cost your company tens of thousands of dollars and potentially your job. And so this is exactly why I created this academy, because I remember what it was like to struggle with the same challenges. And I know how frustrating it can be to feel stuck in your career. And this is also why I'm making this accessible to any serious engineer who's committed to improving their skills. And the small monthly fee is less than what you would pay for a single hour of consultation with an expert. And for that, you get unlimited access to our entire community, all our resources and courses, and support from me and our team of experts. Now, I need to be clear about something. This isn't for everyone. We're looking for engineers who are serious about their craft and committed to putting in the work. We are not looking for people who just want to work and hope that the expertise will somehow be absorbed by osmosis. Because we provide personalized feedback and individual coaching, we must limit our membership. So we want to ensure that every member receives the focus, attention and specialized support they deserve. And so for that reason, there are only a limited number of spots available. So if you are serious about developing your PCB design expertise and positioning yourself as an EMI control specialist, you need to secure your spot now. And I want to be completely transparent about something important. This is an educational investment in your professional development. The electronic design knowledge and EMI control expertise you gain in here will stay with you throughout your entire career. So once you truly understand EMI control principles, that specialized knowledge becomes part of your professional toolkit forever. And like any worthwhile professional education, the value comes from your commitment to learning and applying the principle we teach. So I'm providing you with the specialized knowledge that typically takes years to develop on your own, plus a community of engineers who share your commitment to electronic design excellence. So this is about investing in yourself and your future as a PCB designer and EMI specialist. The specialized knowledge you gain will compound over time as you apply this principle throughout your career. So here's what you need to do right now. Click the button to secure your spot in the academy. Then you will get immediate access to our member portal. You can introduce yourself to the community and you can start getting an answer to your most pressing PCB design and EMI control questions. And remember, you have two paths ahead of you. You can continue struggling with these challenges on your own, watching others advance while you stay stuck, or you can join a community of engineers who are committed to excellence and accelerating each other's career. So the choice is yours, but remember, there are only a limited numbers of spots available at this current rate. Once you're filled, the price will increase to reflect the intensive personalized support we provide. So click the button and let's get started on transforming your skills and your career. And I will see you inside the community. Welcome to your new future as a PCB design and EMI control expert.